Ladies and gentlemen, if you're looking for a gaming Linux distro, then you're in the right place. Today we're having a look at Nobaro uh, Linux, and we're also having a look at Catchy OS. We want to know which one is better, which one is actually going to benefit you. So without further ado, let's dive in. Nobara now is a Fedora based gaming powerhouse so let's look at it a little bit deeper. So merging Fedora's renowned stability with gaming specific optimizations, Nobara represents the perfect balance of enterprise grade reliability and cutting edge gaming performance for discerning enthusiasts. Some of their features, their benefits, and their advantages include the fact that it's built on a stable Fedora with specialized gaming tweaks and proprietary drivers, which are included for optimal out-of-the-box performance. You can also see it has exceptional support for AMD, Intel, NVIDIA GPUs with automatic driver optimization and hardware-specific performance tuning. They have pre-installed Wine, Proton and OBS Studio, which is combined with Fedora security to create the ultimate streaming and gaming platform altogether. And they are community focused. They are community focused with their development. And this ensures continuous improvement, frequent security updates and features that are specifically tailored for the modern gaming needs. The last thing over here you can see is their advanced performance tweaks, as well as their kernel optimizations. So Nobara integrates a custom tuned kernel designed to reduce latency and maximize throughput for gaming workloads, ensuring that your system prioritizes game performance. Some of their key file system optimizations are uh, the F-Sync and E-Sync and an intelligently configured CPU scheduler, which is pre-applied, providing smooth gameplay and faster load times without any manual intervention. The last thing over here is that unlike standard Fedora, Nobara includes proprietary drivers for graphics cards and other hardware out of the box. So this can save you from complex setup processes and it can also ensure that you get peak hardware utilization. Okay, so let's jump straight into some of the features of Catchy OS. So specifically for Linux gaming, it's built on Arc linux with an unwavering focus on gaming performance and a system responsiveness it features a specially tuned kernel engineered for ultra low latency and lightning fast system responses it also um, has some gaming tools included so ships with steam uh, proton and lightris which is pre-configured it's eliminating the setup hassles and getting you gaming literally instantly some of their benefits include maximum performance. So it has minimal system overheads, which ensure that your hardware delivers peak frame rates and buttery smooth gameplay without any unnecessary background processes consuming resources unnecessarily. Then it's always current. So it has a rolling release model, which guarantees your gaming software drivers and system components stay cutting edge with the latest performance improvements the last thing over here is their advantages so the arc linux foundation provides unparalleled customization capabilities allowing advanced users to fine-tune every aspect of their gaming environment to perfection they have a vibrant community that's specially dedicated to gaming enhancements troubleshooting and sharing optimization tips for maximum performance it, has expertly it is expertly optimized for both AMD as well as Intel hardware with bleeding edge drivers and performance patches that are applied automatically. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen, I always advise everybody that watches my videos to make sure that they're going out and using the software for themselves to see if it actually works for them. If this was helpful, drop us a like to show your support. I will see you next time.